Hello and welcome back to the Layers of Fear. We've had a couple of uh, episodes detour where we actually went into the cellar, which led into a Ouija board room, which, after a bit of research, turned out to be part of like some sort of Halloween episode that was completely unrelated to the story of this game. So uh, I'm actually going to proceed into the art room. And actually, ooh, do some story. The door shuts behind me. So this is where all the work takes place. Oh, I can't actually open it. Brushes, etc. Still can't see my reflection. I'm still a vampire. I'm still a creature of the night. I'm so excited for this game. I mean, if that Ouija board bit was just like a, a sort of completely unrelated thing, then uh, I'm so sick and tired of us talking through these notes. We live in the same house, for God's sake. Come talk to me when you've done, before you go to sleep. So, a marriage not going well? More paints and brushes and things. Kind of hyped. Like after after all the sort of suspense, etc., from a non-story oriented thing. Actually get to. There's a letter there, I want to read it, but okay. It's obviously not particularly important. Oh boy. Oh boy, oh boy. Nothing in there. Nothing in there. These are locked. Oh, the happy holidays brushes. Just a mess of broken brushes. Obviously not been having a good time with things. Lost, you deserve it. Finish it. I take it this is the uh It's covered up for a reason, okay. Right. I'm assuming we are going to be finishing the painting somehow. Not much of an artist, but uh well, this is not the way I came in. Oh, and the lighting's changed. And the music's gone eerie. What are we going to expect from this? Nice. Quiet room. Oh, I can see outside. Uh, oh, I, I didn't actually read what they said, just out of something. Okay. Oh, I love this. Changing houses. Rooms. Altering themselves. Presumably, the, oh, no, there's that thing. Oh, nice. Is that like a picture of the wife? Not sure. Scraps of love. It's a nice achievement. Nope, leave the light on. <laughs> Going in circles. Yep, I certainly feel like I am. But the room's changing, so I don't care. Okay. See what's up around and about. Looks like the rain may have stopped. There's no What was that? Paint Papers Note Save the date of blank and blank. Blah 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 blah. Request the pleasure of a company to celebrate the wedding on Saturday the ninth of June. It's a Luke's travel at two o'clock in the afternoon. Ah, oh, so a wedding invite that is um, null and void. 
Oh. Come. Wait, 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 wait. What was the date? What was the date? Nine June, so nine six two. Let's try that. Nine six two. No. Unless it's American, which one is six nine two? No. Still nothing. I'm confused. <laughs> Let's look around at the rest of the room first. Let's see if there's any more of a clue. <laughs> Physics. <laughs> Nothing really there to look at. Another painty, painty piece. Saturday the 9th of June at 2 o'clock. I mean, is it... Second on the night. Six. Nine. Two plus six nine. Yeah. I I don't know. I'm not sure. And I can't leave. Hopeless. So I'm being really dense about this date thing. Saturday, 9th of June. Ah, okay. Oh, I found the code. Five, four, eight. Okay. Five. Maybe I was thinking a little too much into it. There we go. Uh, the past holds back. Look closer. The thought alone Ooh. the most beautiful piece of art doesn't have my name on it is killing me. So, so. will you marry me? That's a really narcissistic way of proposing. You don't have my name on you, marry me. Oh, there's a door there, never forget. I thought that was a weird space between those two busts. So it sort of pays off to be no a little nosy and just sort of click around, even if seemingly for no apparent reason. You've been snooping around my workshop again. For the last time, you are not allowed in that room, even if the door happens to be open. I forbid it. This is your last warning. Next time, you'll have to look for a new job. Okay. Wow. Way to uh, make a mess of the furniture. What have we got here? How many rooms are in this dang house? In fact, how do you have this many rooms and still find a use for them is a better question. Nice cosy warm fire. It's absolutely freezing here today, so I'm just like, ah ha ha, anything to get warm. Oh, criminy, Jesus Christ. Thank you. Trapdoor. What, what are we in the cellar? 
There's lots of sort of weird faces staring out at me. Dust mice, even in my lungs. There is always more grotesque vermin dirt. It's a very terrifying picture of a of a rat. I quite like rats. The artist impression. There's a fair few achievements for not really doing a lot. I mean, this for the most part, this is like a walk around experience. Aside from the um, puzzles, I really can turn the light on. There. Oh. Um. I'm gonna go upstairs now. Don't like it down here. Oh, the footsteps just sound like heartbeats. Oh, secret passage. Oh, we're back in the cozy room. Just the idea of secret passages is very exciting. I'm sure there was a door somewhere. Okay. Because that's not even remotely ominous at all. Now, from past experiences, long corridors are not very pleasant. Especially when they will have portraits staring at you. Oh, Jesus. Paint deep lies. Now, a tiny bit to the left. Yes, just like that. Paint me like one of your French girls, Jack. Oh, it's obviously coming from a happier place. Oh, that shot very violently. Wow. I love a room like this. What the shit? Rat just committed suicide. I just want to have a look around first. Where was the rat? I heard a rat, but I didn't see a rat. Ah! Why are you just running into the fire? Why are they just... Uh. Uh. Okay. Ah! <gasps> sure! Oh, this game's really unsettling. <laughs> uh -huh. Oh, it, it it lulls you into a false sense of security. Let's shut the door. This is a cozy little room. Surely they don't use all these rooms. Every room has just got piles upon piles of books. So it's like, these have got a really broad taste in literature. <laughs> Ooh, we have a letter. Hey, in regards to your previous letter, I'm sure it's nothing to be, to be too concerned about. Women tend to get weird after having a baby. Hormone imbalances and the like. When we had our first, I remember Valerie got the blues real bad. I would ask her what she wanted for lunch and she'd just burst into tears. Just be there for her and I'm sure it's going to be fine. Now I know I promised not to rush you, and by all means enjoy your words of time off, but just to let you know, I'm getting phone calls up the yin-yang. Commissions left and right. You're a hot ticket, my friend. Maybe we should strike the iron while it's hot, but of course the family comes first. Okay. So, postnatal depression, and this guy is suddenly becoming a bit of a celebrity. Hello? There's no need to feel cry. I can't open that door. Are you in there? Hmm. 
Now, my usual instinct is to go left because. Uh, well, whatever reason, I'll go left. Wow, okay. I'm guessing we need the kitchen paprika. Okay. I love it when it gets really quiet like this. Because it, 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 the suspense, it's better than having tense music. Like, literally anything could happen at this point. Something good, something bad. In this case, more than likely, something bad. I'm assuming that was glass. Yikes, all that wine. Exactly, we're away from the kitchen. Okay. This is feeling a bit like a, a walkabout tour of the house, kind of, and, and what's going on. Well, the kitchen's nice and, and warmly lit. So, I did like my little walkabout tour in episode one. I'm just sort of seeing what things are like, and it's interesting to see let's just pop out the painting interesting to see what's happened fruit is popping out of the oven uh, out of the Something weird is going on. A note, but I can't read it. Lots of weird things are happening. Not sure why I did that. I think it was just out of curiosity. Very perplexed about that. What the shit? Ah! There's, um... Wow? Okay. Lots of... I'm slightly lost. I'll get out that way. What's that? First, ah! I looked for a canvas. Not just any canvas. Oh, don't tell me. I had to find a knife. Not one of those bread ones. Needed to be as sharp as a razor. Skin for a canvas? I used a razor, in fact, and then carefully flayed the skin. Whose skin? Who's helped keep my hand steady? What? Oh my god. Okay. I'm starting to see what's going on here. Oh, great. It's the portrait room. Oh. Um. Okay. Guessing this is the first layer. Oh, I see we can collect the pictures. I see. Okay. And we've got the rat thing.
Hate even now. Lost. You deserve it. Finish it. Guess we're, we're sort of uncovering words now. What's that? Deep breaths. Remember, you're a professional. It's just the first few strokes, then you're over the hump. What's so hard about it? He says on a blood splattered note. Okay. Ugh. For a weird moment, I thought they were just going to put skin on the thing. No, we've got. Blood flamingos. Cool. Okay. Right. Well, and that's popped open. Ah, that's the um that's the skin. Uh shapeless dreams. Okie dokie. So I'm gonna leave it here for today. And uh we'll come back to this another time. I hope you guys have enjoyed this. If you have and want to see more, please make sure you subscribe and leave a comment. Let me know what your thoughts are on it. And as ever, I will see you guys next time. Goodbye.